Hey everyone, it's Dr. Simon and I just wanted to show you an exercise that I'm loving right now. What you're gonna need are one or two yoga wedges and then something you can put between your knees. Now this is gonna be a version of a midfoot bridge, so you should really feel a lot of calf and hamstring with this exercise. But what we're gonna do with the wedges is going to angle our feet in different positions to help target either the inner calf and hamstring or the outer calf and hamstring. So the first version I'm gonna show you is with the wedges angled out. You're going to put those up against the wall, put your feet completely on the wedge, yoga block between your knees. And what we're gonna do is you are going to feel the ball of your feet and you are just going to lift your heels up just a little bit, okay? Just to get the calves to kick on. And then from there, I want you to just curl and lift the butt just barely off the ground, okay? My back is still down. My waistband and my pants is still down. It's just the base of my butt coming off, okay? What you should start to feel in this position is a lot more inner calf, inner hamstring, and even some of those inner thighs, all right? If you wanna switch it up and get the opposite, you'll just rotate those wedges. So now they're angled in, yoga block between the knees, and then go ahead, just lift those heels slightly, curl and lift, okay? This is gonna help light up more of the outer calves and outer hamstrings. Hold for what you think you can. Sometimes it's only six seconds, sometimes it could be 20 seconds, and do as many sets as you feel comfortable with. What I want people to be careful of is a lot of times I see people arching their back off with bridges, and we really wanna make sure we're curling the back, just lifting the base of the butt off. 